thanks for joining me. So today's video is going to be a mini haul that I got from NARS. Some of you may be aware that NARS opened their very first flagship store here in Las Vegas in Caesars Palace. So the other night um, I was invited with a group of ladies to go and actually see the store. They did a little demo for us and then allowed us to shop. So. Um, it's just a few things that I picked up, not a lot. I picked up the Light Reflecting Setting Powder in Loose. They also have it in a pressed form, which is fine. However, I do prefer the Loose. This one is the Crystal. It comes in a jar. I just opened it. You can see some of the powder. With this here, just a little bit, it does go on very smoothly just want to tap that brush out a little bit very very finely milled product i believe it is another one of their um another one of their triple milled powder products so anytime anything is triple milled usually it's very fine but i do like to just kind of press that and roll it onto the skin and it is gorgeous I discovered this product a few years ago while working at Nordstrom when NARS first launched it and I didn't pick it up and I regretted it the whole time so I picked it up there and so that's that that's the light reflecting powder in crystal the second product that I picked up is a cream shadow called Pearl Beach and it's this little guy here I don't do a lot of shadows from other companies only because I have so much makeup that usually once you have something by one company you kind of have it all but this is one of those products where I played with it in store and I was like throw that in the bag like I have to have that it is really pretty so I'm gonna show you on my hand you can't really see it that's the only thing it's very sheer um, I'm doing this video at about 7 at night right now, so you can't see it too much. The reason I picked this up, it is a cream shadow, but this is going to look gorgeous when I do any type of highlighting because it is, again, a cream. So it's going to reflect off the skin beautifully. So, again, this is their cream shadow in Pearl Beach. You know what it kind of reminds me of? Like, a s very, very similar to Triple Impact by MAC. Have you guys seen that, used that before? Let me see if I can find it. So this is the NARS Pearl Beach. This is MAC Triple Impact. Extreme Dimension. I am kind of obsessed with this. I wish MAC would make their Extreme Dimension products permanent. This has a little more color to it when I... Oh, got a lot more color actually in the light. I don't know if you can see that. Hold on. Yeah, the only thing with the Triple Impact is it does have a very um, lilac-y base to it. Oh, this lighting is horrible. Um, but that is the triple impact right here and then the pearl beach is next to it mm, and triple impact has a lot more shimmer to it they're both really pretty i do kind of think that i would prefer the nars for a little more of a subtle highlight effect next product that i picked up was their radiant cream compact foundation so it comes in a box like this the only thing is that you do have to be aware of what you're asking for when you go and request this product. So I got Stromboli in this, which is, I believe it's medium three. Yes, medium three Stromboli. When you open this up, you're gonna get a little sponge and also the compact packaged. So you're gonna just open that up. Now I picked up two shades, one as a foundation shade and one as a darker shade. I do work on a lot of deeper complected clients, 
but I also found that this would make a really nice um, bronzing kind of uh, contouring color for myself also. So I did pick up a Dark 3 in Benares. I have no idea how to say that, so correct me if I'm wrong. Anyway, that's that. This is cream. Like all cream products, you want to minimize the exposure to air. So it has, it says, press firmly until sealed. It has four little arrows. So you just make sure that all corners are sealed. Now, they are going to try and upsell you on the compact. The foundations alone are, I believe, $37 or $38 with the sponge. They will sell you a pretty little black NARS compact that's going to hold the actual insert, the foundation insert, the sponge, and also comes with a pretty generously sized mirror. That is for an additional $10. I decided to skip that because I'm not one to carry my compact around with me during the day, like my foundation especially. I actually really like this foundation and I've been wearing it for a couple of days prior to making this video for the sake of doing a review. So I will speak more to the um, the claims and like the properties of the actual makeup in a separate video if you're interested in that. I'll make sure that I have that link to this video below. So that was my little mini NARS haul. Not a lot for products still ran me like hundred and something dollars. NARS, get it together. Why are you so expensive? Um, I'm trying to get their pro discount, so hopefully that goes through. They were generous enough to give us a 30% discount when we did shop with them that night, so it helps out a little, but still they are a little more on the higher end for cosmetic brands. Um, definitely not um, what I'm used to with MAC, so... But thanks for watching guys and please make sure that you like and comment if you have any questions. Definitely subscribe and I'm going to be trying to get new videos out to you every week. So we'll see how that goes. Thanks for joining me. Have a great night guys.